Do you find it difficult to multiply large numbers in your head? Sometimes you just need to write it down. I'm going to show you how to use the grid method to make multiplication much easier. Imagine your school is having a large end of year party and they want to buy 32 boxes of party poppers. Each box costs £13, but your school can only spend £400. You want to work out if the school can actually buy all of these party poppers with the money that they have. We would need to do 13 times 32 for the total price. But how can we do this easily? The grid method is simple. First, we need to partition the numbers to make them more manageable. So 13 becomes 10 and 3, and 32 is 30 and 2. Now we need to draw the grid and pop our numbers in. So we'll put 10 and 3 on the left hand side, then 30 and 2 above. Next we can start to multiply the numbers and then add them all up in the end. The times tables are really useful here. I'll show you what I mean. We start with the first row. 30 times 10 equals 300. And 2 times 10 equals 20. So 300 plus 20 equals 320. Then for the second row. 30 times 3 equals 90. I know this because 3 times 3 is 9. So 3 times 3 tens are 9 tens, which is 90. 2 times 3 equals 6. So 90 plus 6 equals 96. Now all we need to do is add 320 and 96. We can use the column method to do this. I'll start with the units. So 0 plus 6 is 6. 2 plus 9 is 11. So I'll write the 1 in the tens column and carry the other 1. 3 plus 1 equals 4. So my final answer is 416. Check out our video on column addition if you need more help with that. Going back to our question, the school only has £400 to spend, but the party poppers cost £416, so they can't buy 32 boxes of party poppers, they can only buy 30. Here's something else for you to try, it's not as tough as you think. Try using the grid method to work out 12 times 113. And here's a hint, it's the exact same method, just partition 113 into three numbers, units, tens and hundreds. Show it to your tutor at your next Tutors United lesson when you're done. For more maths and English tips, check out our YouTube channel or you can visit our website at tutorsunited.org.